Radius neighborhood targeting for cleaning businesses. You can own any neighborhood and be the neighborhood cleaner by using Radius neighborhood targeting. Now there are ways to do this online and offline. We've had other videos and other courses where we've talked about how to do it with Google ads and even Facebook ads, and it's a smart idea to do both. What we're gonna be talking about here in this video is how to do this with postcard marketing. So what you can do is you can actually target through either every door direct mail or through radius neighborhood targeting through our mail house. You can target specific neighborhoods based on either income or areas of town or household values or sending five arounds or sending to a certain zip code or all of the above through radius targeting or through every door direct mail. Used to, it was only every door direct mail. Now we have different versions to be able to recommend to you. So we've got some updated things that I wanna go over with you. So four steps to getting your neighborhood postcards done. First and foremost, you need to go and you need to find out if every door direct mail is the way to do it. There are similar programs in Canada and the UK, uh, but in the United States, every door direct mail may be your best bet, possibly if it fits the certain couple of scenarios we're gonna go over here in just a second. So go to their tool, I'll maybe put the link below this video, but you can Google EDDM, United States Postal Service, mail route, chooser, picker, search for, for mail routes, some of these keywords that you see listed here, and you'll see something like this. And what's gonna happen is you put in a zip code and you go through and you hover over and you pick a particular mail route. So EDDM is based on a mail route, and it's usually anywhere between 300 and about 1,200 homes. In this case, this is 605 homes. It tells you how much it actually is. Sometimes it even gives you an approximate income level, which don't take for gold because it's very approximate, but at least it gives you kind of a general idea. But you can go in and hover and pick. Now, the thing that you need to do is you need to very securely know this particular neighborhood that you're marketing to. So you need to actually have a Google map and or already know what's in this neighborhood and go through, maybe even drive through and find out, are there any apartments? Really what you're looking for is this the neighborhood that you really want to target? And you need to target at least a slightly above or a much above average type of neighborhood, right? And then you want to make sure that there are no apartments, ideally, unless you like to target apartments or, or townhomes, or keep in mind too, with EDDM, you're targeting homes. You can target businesses along with homes, but it's really mostly homes. So there are other ways that we're going to talk about in a second to target businesses and to target other specifics, and that's through our mail house that we're going to be going over in just a second. But if EDDM is suitable for you, it's going to be you're looking at this mail route that you're picking and going, yes, mail route number and if you're looking at this oh it shows right up here the mail route number up in this area so if you do, do decide to mail to the entire mail route and it looks good to you EDDM is going to be your best bet because it's normally cheaper. Now that's of course unless you're mailing a lot. If you are mailing more than 2,500, it still might be better to go through our mail house. It might be cheaper and even less of a task for you to go through our mail house. But if you're mailing less than 2,500 and you want to hit everything in this neighborhood, then EDDM is your best route. 2,500 or less, EDDM would be your best route. So now let's say you, you looked at your neighborhood and you've driven through, you looked on Google Maps and you're going, well I don't want to hit everybody in that neighborhood. Or you're saying I want to hit everybody in a certain zip code valued at prices over uh, you know a certain house value or a certain income level and you do want to send more than 2500 then our mail house is going to be your best bet because they can do all sorts of things pulling lists based on even pet owners pulling lists based on household value income they can do five rounds of your own targeted clients or around a specific list that you've got. They can target just specific zip codes, one mile radiuses if you want around a certain house. Whatever that you want to do, they can do very well for you. And if that's the case, then the radius targeting through our mail house would be the best route to go. So the thing that you need to do is first figure out which way to go. If you're mailing 2,500 or more, probably the mail house is the better route. If it's less than 2,500 and you want to mail to everybody in that particular mail route, then you're going to probably want to do EDDM. Now keep in mind, both of these are scenarios that you can either do yourself or you can actually go through, actually with EDDM, it's more likely to be able to try to do that yourself. Um, it's a little bit more difficult to do business mailing yourself if you're mailing to specific routes, though, and you probably do want to use our mail house that we work with very closely inside of the Ad Coaching Club. So 
you decide first, are you going to do EDDM or not? If you are doing EDDM, you're going to be picking out, you're going to be go to the Ad Club site, you're going to go to EDDM category and pick out anything that says EDDM is already geared specifically, sized, and it's even designed to be an EDDM mailer. And so that's going to usually look like on the other side, something like this. It's going to say local postal service. And it's going to have the insignia there. Now, the neat thing is you all you have to do is pick out one of these postcards and then go to the free graphic design tab and we'll actually customize these mailers for you as part of the ad club once per month at no charge. It's included with your ad club membership. All you have to do is fill out the form. We also, if you want to do it yourself, we give you a free version of Photoshop to be able to use to try to design it yourself if you'd like to design it yourself. But whenever we design it for you, we'll make sure whether you're doing EDDM or whether you're doing radius targeting, we'll make sure that all of it's done the right way. And if you're wondering which route that you want to go, uh, if you don't know, just put down in here, I don't know if I want to do EDDM or radius targeting and just let us know what you're trying to do and we'll make sure that we'll, we walk you through the right way of doing it. So, uh, that's, but you got to find which postcard that you want to do, pick that out. Now, if you're going to be doing EDDM and or even doing radius targeting, um, ideally there's two ways to do it. You're either going to mail once per month, maybe that entire neighborhood every month, and keeping in mind that the more repetition you give them, the better you're going to be known, and the quicker that you'll be a neighborhood cleaner, known as a neighborhood cleaner, the first couple of times you mail it, and say, hey, I'm the neighborhood cleaner, they're not going to believe you, you're right? you got to do it several times. So there's two ways to do it. You can either mail them once per month, or you can mail them in a flight sequence, which in marketing, that is something like you'd mail it like on today, on a, on a Monday, you'd mail them a week later on a Monday, and you mail them another week later on a Monday, and then you wouldn't mail them at all for several months, and then you'd start that whole process process over again. Either way that you want to do it really is probably fine. Keeping in mind that, you know, it takes several touches for you to really solidify yourself as the neighborhood cleaning company. So we have these follow-ups that say last chance, second chance, that type of thing. Again, if you're wondering where those are at, we can help you find them, but they're there in the EDDM category. So those are some of the EDDMs that we do. Now, if you're doing a neighborhood radius, either a five around or any type of a radius targeting mailer, you're going to want to mail a slightly smaller mailer. And again, when you let us know what you're trying to do, uh, we'll be able to walk you through this and make sure you're doing the right thing. Um, if you're going to be doing an EDDM, it has to be a certain height and a certain width. And again, they're already categorized as EDDM, so you can't really go wrong there. If you're going to be doing a neighborhood radius targeting through our mail house, then you probably want to have something that's less than six inches and less than 11 inches wide to be able to get the cheaper postage route. You can mail the bigger ones, but the postage can be a lot more. So again, we'll make sure that you're doing the right things as long as you tell us what you're trying to do. A lot of the messages are the same type of thing. We're saying you're the neighborhood cleaner and uh, we're putting pictures of maybe your company van. It could be your staff. It could be you. It could, could be all sorts of things, but you want to make sure that you're putting yourself out as being real. Right, and the other side, different gifts. Don't get bogged down with what the offers are. You can put whatever offers that you want. We've even got this one that's both a EDDM and also a uh, neighborhood uh, radius mailer, both both scenarios, uh, where it's just a $25 gift card, $25 off your first service, that type of thing, telling about all the different services that you do. It's springtime cleaning, that type of stuff. So, so the big thing is, again, if you are targeting 2500 or more, you probably want to use the mail house because it's going to be about the same price. Um, if you're targeting less than 2500 and you want to hit every home in that mail route, then EDDM is going to for sure be your best route to go. We also have a complete guide on how to get the EDDM done if you want to do it yourself. Uh, that's going to be right here. It's also in the main menu of the Ad Club site. Go through, look through this thoroughly. And if you have any questions too, just let us know. We're That's totally what we're here for, to answer all your questions about how to do that. Uh, and then uh, just after you get it designed, just fill out a printing form. You don't have to have us printed, but we are brokers for some large printers. A lot of the times we can get you the cheapest prices for printing that you can get anywhere else and we can help you facilitate the mailing, make sure that it's all done the right way. All you have to do is fill out the printing tab under here. And again, to get the graphic design done, that is filling out this form right here. You can either do it yourself or you can have us professionally do it for you or you can fill out the printing tab if you want us. Again, you can use your own printer if you want. 
Check the prices if you like to. We've got the entire price list right here. But 99% of the time, our printing is going to be less than anywhere else around. Just fill out the form. Make sure we've got your credit card on file. If we've not got it, you can put it into the secure form down here. So get the neighborhood mailing done. This is one of the top ways to be the neighborhood cleaning company of choice.